Hi, good evening, everyone. Uh, this evening, I'm nominating Grace Jin for her work with the Unemployment Project. Uh, she's assisted by, uh, um, by uh, about six of our staff, and as well as a number of volunteers that have been working on this project. As, you, as all of us know, um, underemployment and loss of work hours was hitting our community uh, by, by February as uh, businesses, restaurants in the neighborhood were um, uh, just less crowded because of people's concerns about COVID-19. Uh, Grace joined uh, the Poitok Center first as a ESL student uh, last year. Uh, she came uh, to the States and, and was trying to improve her English. And then uh, because she had a HR background, we invited her to join our staff. And so she's been serving as our ESL transitions coordinator, basically helping our ESL students uh, find jobs. But when um, more and more of our students became unemployed, uh, we talked about how to help them. And uh, so, so she is, uh, along with other volunteers, uh, developed bilingual resources because uh, right now you can only apply for unemployment online in English, Spanish, or Polish. And so many people needed help. And so she uh, developed these, she along with others developed these resources uh, to help people apply on, on their own. Uh, for those who really had uh, limited English or limited technology, they would try to help um, people. Uh, uh, so far, uh, they've also been helping uh, troubleshoot um, for those who have a lot of difficulty. Uh, so far, this group has helped 400 uh, people with their unemployment claims, and over uh, 1,700 people have viewed the website that uh, holds the bilingual um, uh, uh, information about uh, unemployment. Uh, when I, when she, I first asked her to do this project, I said, if you could help 50 people, you'd be doing a great job. So, so she's helped, this group has helped 400 people. And I've done, done some rough, rough calculations. If they could all get the federal $600 per week and plus uh, maybe $300 from the state government, um, the work together has collectively helped uh, or, or, or helped uh, families get $4.6 million over the first three months of this effort. And so this is one way that um, she has served the community, helping people pay their rent, pay their groceries, and it's it's wonderful to be able to nominate her and those that have worked with her.